Well, the father of the accused Highland Park mass shooter back in court today, Bob Cremo Jr., formally indicted on reckless conduct charges. WGN's Julian Cruz was at the hearing. Hey guys, 58-year-old Bob Cremo Jr. pleading not guilty, now formally indicted on seven reckless conduct charges. He is accused of sponsoring his son's application for a firearms registration card. This was years before the 4th of July shooting, even though the then 19-year-old appears to have had mental health issues. Lake County State's Attorney Eric Reinhardt in a written statement saying, quote, Parents who are reckless when they help their kids get weapons of war are morally and legally responsible for the harm that follows. We presented our evidence to a grand jury and they agreed the case should move forward. Reinhardt says Bob Cremo Jr. should have known better. Years before the 4th of July shooting, his son Bobby Cremo III reportedly trying to kill himself in 2019, later threatening to kill everyone in his family. Cremo III remaining at the Lake County, Illinois jail, accused of shooting and killing seven, wounding 48 others in Highland Park. The elder Cremo avoiding news cameras on this elevated walkway into the courthouse, arriving for today's arraignment, where his lawyers entered a not guilty plea. In the past, Cremo Jr.'s lawyer, George Gomez, arguing that the state's case against his client is weak. We're a little surprised of the indictment. Gomez not elaborating further after today's arraignment, but he contends that Bob Cremo Jr. cannot be held responsible for the alleged actions of his son. I do believe that at the end of the day that Mr. Cremo will be vindicated of these charges. Bob Cremo Jr. expected to be back in court in April. In Waukegan, Julian Cruz, WGN News.